Did stream die? Yeah, it died for uh, oh, about a minute. So I had to restart it, sadly. Not sure why, like it... It, um... My internet came back up almost straight away, but... That didn't sound good. Try not to uh, fall to it the wouldn't disconnect. The master override doesn't override gravity. Keep holding, keep holding. Yay. You were just in a meeting? Hopefully, a good meeting. I just found out I have to go to work tomorrow on my day off. Thanks, Microsoft and CrowdStrike, for having a global outage and making me have to go in on my day off. It's great, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> uh, you're here. Actually, yeah. For a moment. What? Our journey together has come to an end, Aloy. But before I go, I think I owe it to you to tell you the rest of the story. Go on. Some time ago, I admitted that I'd been involved with the Eclipse. But I never told you the full extent of my culpability. Have you never primary is, work all morning? I was there at the beginning. You bet an hour before I, I finish work today does everything to the done. Buried on that mountain, trapped in that shattered tower. So sat and talked for half an hour and the boss is like, yes, and go I home. Served it. <laughs> what? Nothing we can do. It promised knowledge. And but then the support team's like, yeah, we need to get everything back up on Saturday. Such knowledge. You have no idea. Who can come in? And in exchange? I helped create the Eclipse. Helped it build a cult. An army to do its will. Why are you telling me this now? Because your success depends on knowing this. When I found Hades, the first thing it wanted to know about was the Spire. Not Meridian. The Spire. Now why would that be? The Spire was created by Gaia. Which part of Gaia? M Minerva. Its code-breaking module. Gaia built spires to transmit the codes that deactivated the Pharaoh robots, shut down their biomatter conversion systems. Hades wants to send a new transmission to wake the machines so they can devour the world all over again. Yes. Based on what we've learned, that's my conclusion as well. So the Eclipse, the robots they've resurrected, they're just a means to an end. An army to capture the Spire. Yes. So Hades can exterminate life all over again. Unless you stop it. I want you to tell me everything. Hades, the Eclipse. Everything. It's a long story, Aloy. Then get started. It began with a focus. Recovered from an ancient ruin, as yours was so many years ago. In my case, the device was heavily damaged. There was just a flicker of life in it. I spent weeks studying it, attempting repairs, until finally, I succeeded. A whole new dimension of perception revealed, right before my eyes. That's when I detected it. A faint signal. Out there, something was searching, just like I was. A real kindred spirit. I followed the signal to its source. A shattered titan buried in the jungles of the Jew. So you thought it was a titan? An old war machine? I didn't know what to think. I'd seen such wreckage before. The Grave Horde, for example. But this was different. This was not quite dead. It couldn't speak when I found it, until my repairs gave it a voice. So began an exchange of knowledge. It wanted to know everything about our world, 
its tribes and machines. But the spire was always its foremost concern. What did it want to know about the spire? Its precise location, the surrounding geography, who controlled the land. Meanwhile, Hades revealed to me many of the intricacies of ancient technology. It bid me to recover and repair more focuses. Before long, I had a couple dozen up and running. Enough to equip a small army. The commanders of one, anyway. I didn't care. I was learning so much. Physics, calculus. You have no idea. And the Shadow Karja? How did they become involved? The Karja Civil War was a happy coincidence. A perfect opportunity. <laughs> An opportunity? That's what it was to you? Yes. Overnight, half the tribe was in exile, desperate to win back Holy Meridian. Their religion made them easy to manipulate. All I had to do was present Hades as the buried shadow of their mythology. So yes, it was an opportunity. I arranged for High Priest Bahavas to meet with Hades. Helis was there as well. And so the Eclipse was born. Anything to win back Holy Meridian. But Hades didn't care about Meridian. And neither did you. We live in a world of fallen cities and vanished tribes. What were a few more? Besides, All for the power of knowledge. I was too busy setting up the cult's focus network to Hades' specifications. <laughs> a thrilling technical challenge. Especially with the alterations I included of my own design. The ability for you to spy on them. Yes. I may have been foolish enough to serve Hades, but I was never so foolish that I trusted it. I installed what the ancients used to call a back door in the network. Secret access, empowering me to monitor all activity and communications. What made you turn on Hades? It certainly wasn't your conscience. Actually, I was troubled the first time I saw the Eclipse raise an ancient war robot with my technology. I questioned Hades about its intentions. A little late? Indeed. I'd already outlived my usefulness. When I completed work on the Focus Network, Hades summoned me to receive my reward. The next moment, I heard it broadcast my kill order. I've been a fugitive ever since. So when did I come into this? Our path together? When Olin stumbled on you. System threat detected. That got my attention. A kill order against a savage Nora girl? Why would Hades bother with that? But then I saw that this Nora girl was wearing a focus and bore an uncanny resemblance to a great scientist of the old world. Helis moved quickly. I thought you were dead. But then I detected your focus inside the Nora mountain. The more I observed you, the more convinced I became of your extraordinary nature and usefulness. Through you, I could finally discover the secrets of the Earth. I vowed to do everything I could to ensure your success. The rest, as they used to say, is history. I kind of want to go with this one. But knowing Aloy, it'll be far more aggressive than I want it to be. The things you've done in the pursuit of knowledge, Silence. Pure recklessness. Aloy, this wasn't a confession to elicit your judgment. <sighs> Unbelievable. I've done all I can. From here on out, the rest is up to you. Take my lance. Fit the Master Override to it and you have a means of injection. Then I just need to get close enough to Hades' skull to stab it in? Exactly. Oh, no problem. <laughs> That's it. Silence. Where will you go? Elsewhere. And everywhere. 
There's so much more to discover before the world ends. And all this? I leave it to you, of course. As it turned out, it was yours all along. I was merely trespassing. Upgraded sphere, maybe? I traveled far to find you. I heard your transmission. It was you, wasn't it? Entity is not known. I'm called Silence, and you are. I don't think you'd have called out if it wasn't something you wanted. You called, I responded. Will you tell me your name? Hades. You are a creation of the ancients. A war machine. Define timeline. Time? Ah. It is the 13th king of the Karja Sundom's reign. Define Karja. We're getting ahead of ourselves. Were you created by the ancients? I wonder how long you waited here buried until I chanced upon you. How long you'd have to wait for another. You're obviously very powerful, but you're not going to get anywhere without me. Titan Flame merely houses intellect. Define Karja. Now that's more like it. Yeah. They're coming. Preparations are complete. Ah, loosen the Bahamas. Behold. As I promised you. What? Manner of great machine is this? I've never seen such a thing. Stay! Stay your ground, Karcha in shadow! Incorrect. Bow before the buried shadow. The buried shadow? I... I don't understand. Did Araman understand the Glint Hawk? That perch upon the alight. It speaks scripture. Araman followed the shadow cast from the spire. To the mesa where Holy Meridian was founded. You will follow the shadow once more. I am a righteous man. Chosen of the sun. But in times of need, the powers of shadow can accomplish what the sun alone cannot. Will... Will you return to us what is ours, O oh, Shadow of Prophecy? An army is required. Obey and meridian. No! Oh, I think it'll be the end anyway. Task is complete. Yes. The focus network is active, built to your specifications. Check it yourself if you must. I'll wait. But... I remind you of the reward you've been withholding. Quantum processing? Data has been compiled. Volume too great for transfer. How... inconvenient for me. Come before me. You shall receive your reward. Very well. Helis. Threat detected inside Eclipse. Speak its name, O oh Shadow, and it will die. You will eliminate this one. Silence. Silence. Yes. A truth whispered at night is seen in the day. He was never one of us. It will be done. Hmm. So, upgraded spear. It does significantly more damage. <sighs> really, one skill point. One skill point. The looming shadow. Level thirty-four.
Level am I? 30. I'm gonna have to do a couple of like side missions to get good enough. Really under leveled. We just risk it and see. If we get absolutely crushed, maybe we'll do some side missions. Think of the sun on your skin. Where am I? Oh, that's where I am. I was like, it didn't look right, but I just needed to go halfway around the corner. Mark my words. Ooh, we could investigate the crime scene, actually. It's always the ones you least expect. You Talk to the steward optional. Oh, there it is. How did I miss that? You saw the thief make a run for it? My back was to the wall, you see. Yeah, Wasn't expecting wall, someone see? to crawl out the window. He ran past me, dressed in grey, clutching the sword. That's all I saw. By the sun, my heart nearly seized up. Yeah. Is this the crime scene? Drops of blood bleeding away. More blood. Maybe if I'm I can still on the trail. Sort of punch out a couple of little side quests. I might be able to get to a little closer on the level for damage. Still more blood. The thief got cut. The trail ends here. Not sitting well with Someone me. must have seen the thief. Long night last night. Did someone run past here, holding a sword? Sure did. He grabbed some linen off the stand here and took off down the stairs behind you. He was bleeding, so maybe he needed a binding. Blast it! That was expensive cloth. I can't believe I paid for that thief's bandage. My boss said he lost another caravan in the machines last week. Doc, my yeah. Take a minute for myself. If the thief came this way, there's only one way he could have gone. Forward. No sign of the thief. Someone must have seen him go by. Did you see anyone run through here? He would have been holding this a sword. Named NPC, right? Yeah, almost crashed into me too. He ran down the parapet here and went down the lift. No way you'll catch him now. I didn't see a sword though. He wasn't carrying anything. Not a damn thing. Just ran like his ass was on fire. 
Oh, boy. The thief must have ditched the sword. But where? Maybe he had help. That merchant stall would have been a convenient drop off. Wasn't sure about the Sundom at first, but, uh. Tired of being tired, that's for sure. It looks like the thief got away, but without the sword. I thought maybe he dropped it off somewhere. Like here, for instance? What? No. I had nothing to do with it. We play in LA now. I guess we'll see when I get the city guard to toss your stall and question your customers. Uh, hold on. <laughs> There's more to this. You've got a reputation for shining light in the darkness, so I know you'll listen. You're right. The sword was passed to me, and I passed it on to someone else. It's going to be sold, but not for profit. The shards will go to people in need. You expect me to believe that? I can prove it. Meet my friends at the water mill in the lower village. They'll explain everything. If they don't convince you, come right back with the guards. I'm not going anywhere. Box, box, it wouldn't box. matter if you did. I'd find you. <sighs> but all right. I'll check out the water mill. Okay. Guess what's I up, Sola? This water mill then to find out what's going on. Oh, welcome. Where is this water mill? Do I continue down? Perhaps. What if you hadn't been there to protect the Sun King? It would have been a dip. Up here. Get the lift and head down. Just wake up, how am I? I am doing pretty good. For Friday. It's always the ones you least expect that cause you trouble. A little tired, ready for bed, but I really want to finish this game. Problem is, it's throwing me a curveball and I'm like four levels under power for the... What I'm assuming is like the final, final battle. So I'm just doing... I thought I'll just do this side mission because it's nice and handy and close. Always gonna wait for these elevators. Might be longer than you think it would be. Really? I don't know if I like that that answer, Halleck. <laughs> now that I know I've got to get up in the morning and go to work. Maybe what we do is we just uh, bust out some side missions and do get some leveling and then maybe do the finale tomorrow. If, uh, if you think that that final mission or the, like, the final sort of story push is going to be particularly long. It's too hot right now. I'm sitting here with a heater on. So uh, it gives you a bit of an idea of what it's like here. I don't want to think about what would have happened without you there to save the Sun King. I'll make you a deal. The last thing I want is you making any more deals today. If you'll see Sans about this Snap Ma lens, you don't have to admit you were wrong. Can you continue to talk to me? Sometimes I wish a Snap Ma would drag you off into the jungle. I remember I helped these guys. I wish they have signed more? up for the Vanguard. It... They just keep no. going. Just keep arguing. I'll make you a deal. The last thing I want oh, is I'm you making side. any more deals today. Can I just if jump over and swim? Yeah, I think maybe that's the plan. Maybe, maybe some side missions before we finish, and then the finale tomorrow. Then. 
I'll actually work out well. It'll allow me to level up a little bit.